Okay, here we go. We're coming down for, for landing. Successful landing. Thank you very much, folks. We'll be doing these demos on the hour, so come back. And yeah, feel free to come ask us everything you want to know about engineering. How long can it fly? Not much longer than that. Oh, about, it's about, uh, I, think, I think the longest one we've had is over two minutes, okay. something like that. About a charge time then. Oh, it, it, I think like half a day oh, really? to a day. Yeah, I mean, we're, we're talking solar here. Yeah. And we've got a solar panel that's now getting more caked with dust. Yeah. And Mars is not really that solar friendly anyways, right? So, uh, but actually most of the power goes towards just keeping it heated. Oh, really? Because oh. it's so cold uh, Interesting. Mars. Yep. Uh, Will the rover make it all the way or get stuck? <laughs> Mission control. Are you ready? Yeah. Ready. Mission start. All right, guys, here we go. Three, two, one. Another plateau of data dunes. The rover is sending its data back to the satellite. The satellite is transmitting to JPL. Mission oh, yeah. scientists are reviewing the data. They're publishing it in peer-reviewed journals. Very nice. I thought it was going to be very nice. A little extra there. How about that? Ah, yeah, nice, nice massage. Oh, yeah. Hey. Oh, yeah, there you go. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, I like the massage. That was good. We're contacting Mission Control. <laughs> mission Control, what is mission status? All right, success, everybody. Mission success. Thank you, Marshall Landscape. <laughs> I'm Lori Leshen, director of JPL. I'd like to welcome you to the center of the universe here at NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory. Why do we call this room the center of the universe? Well, take a look around. The people in this room monitor the vast communication network that tracks all spacecraft data to and from deep space. The deep space network team is sitting here in the first two rows. We have three rotating teams that keep our mission data flowing 24 hours a day, seven days a week. To my right, you'll see a visualization showing the three DSN antenna complexes located throughout the world. The squiggly lines represent commands being sent up to the spacecraft and data flowing down from across the solar system. Also to my right, you may recognize our mission support area. If you watch the Perseverance rover touch down on the surface of Mars, you remember seeing mission team members celebrating right in there. For over 50 years, we've been exploring our solar system with spacecraft like Cassini, 
that gave us a glimpse of Saturn's mesmerizing rings and multiple moons. To the twin voyagers that have reached the very edge of our solar system and continue to send back science data as they venture into interstellar space. In the coming years, we will send a spacecraft to investigate potential oceans on Jupiter's fascinating moon Europa and continue our search for ancient life on Mars as we recover the rock samples being gathered by Perseverance right now with the Mars Sample Return Mission. Thanks for stopping by our Mission Operations Center and enjoy your day here at JPL, where we dare mighty things together. Thank you.